Whether you are new to the job market or looking to make a change in the new year, there are some important things to know now. Career consultant Karen Kodzik is here with some ways to stand out so you get hired. Great to see you and Happy Thank New Year you. to you. Same to you. This year, we, we are seeing that there is some movement. What's going to be different this year, do you think, approaching uh, getting hired from last year? You know, I think the economy continues to improve. Um, since the recession years, where organizations were in a hunker down mode, I think there's more movement. We're seeing more movement within organizations and with or other organizations coming together. It creates a sense of optimism. So people are looking around. Right. Even if they have a job currently, yes. they want to move. There's been a lot of stagnation with that. Yes. So uh, discuss some of these things. You have five tips that we're going to present yeah. to folks today who are watching. Be clear and focused about what job you want. You have to know what you want. That's right. And it's not uncommon where people will quickly say, well, I can do that. And I say, well, but you, do you want to do that? And be, spe be specific. Sometimes I ask people, what do you want to do? They'll say, well, I like working with people. It's a broad that, area. That, that's, that's a, a big that's, net. That's yeah. a big net. Mm -hmm. So really, you know, getting clear about what are the jobs that you're targeting that you want to do, not the ones that you just can do. We will keep with clarity with the second one. Make yes. sure your message is crafted in a way that clearly communicates what you can offer the employer. I think so often we think, well, I'm bright and eager hire me, but you have to have an idea or something yes. that you bring, right? You have to really be able to connect the dots for that employer from what you have in your arsenal, if you will, of your skills and what that means for them. And so really connecting those dots is the job of the job seeker. And know what that is. Be consistent is. with your message on your resume, online and in the interview. You should be consistent. That's right. I think it's very important that whatever your message is to the marketplace is very clear on your resume when you're creating your linkedin profile that messaging continues there and actually when you're doing self-promotion within the interview that's consistent as well approach your search purposely and with a plan yes so. it, this is this is a big project it takes people years and years to get into a rut it takes a while to get out in terms of a job it's good to have a plan be positive be engaging and build advocates i'm glad you mentioned linkedin because the yes. social networking piece is enormous now isn't it it is and it's really relationships are key who are the people you know who's going to introduce you to others and to opportunities that's really a good place to start thank you for getting us jump started today great yes. to have you here from thank cultivating you. careers karen kodzik great to have you here you can find a link to cultivating careers on care11.com click on the 4 p.m homepage. we'll be